don't know, he's standing up. He's going to win mega millions here shortly in the lottery. Mr. Steve Murphy is going to be evaluating Burbank and Steve. Gentlemen, and especially Kurt Baker, thank you for the opportunity to take value of your speech, value of the here and now. Now, I have this down as speech number five, your body speaks. Um, now, that is all about stance, movement, gestures, and facial expression. So I don't think the speech I heard was really took that to heart. I thought you could, it was a very well-crafted speech. Your delivery was fine. You're very comfortable up here. But I thought you could have done more on some of these items just to bring your body and bring your enthusiasm and your knowledge base to bear. For instance, the gestures. A point one time you talked about a shirt being real tight. You really showed the gesture. I thought that was great. That's the kind of direction I'd like to move in. Another time you talked about a suitcase. That's a great time you can use a gesture and just carry that suitcase around. Or another time you talk about external and, and internal fa uh, factors. You know, it's a, it's a great opportunity to use contrast in your body language. Or the other time when you talk about banter, you know, speaking, just you know, do something like that. That's what come, came to mind. So there's all kinds of opportunities in your speech to use gestures. So I encourage you to explore that and just have fun up here do that. And I thought your, your stance was good. Again, you were very comfortable. I thought you didn't move around comfortably on the stage. I thought maybe some of your movements may be uh, a, a little too much. So I was just, you know, I, I have this, I have a habit of staying still, but other people may move too much. So just, uh, you know, give a point, move around a little, especially if there's a real a reason for it, then stop and then give another point. So just be aware a little more of your, jet, of your movement, uh, and that would be good. And the uh, facial expression, I, uh, again, I, th I thought you know your facial expression more wasn't uh, uh, it wasn't uh, maybe as robust or as you know it wasn't like a cartoon character or a mime. It was more like a mime. So again, again that may be a natural thing, but just consider doing you know happy when you're happy, just you know maybe smile. When Curious, maybe just scratch your head. That's an easy way of exploring the curious nature to everybody without having to do something funny with your face. So, so again, I encourage you to look, uh, you know, think about movements, gestures, facial expressions a little bit more, and uh, and I think you're.